course, going to a gym or getting on a treadmill is important because that's going to raise your heart rate, which also has some heart health benefits as well. But the other key is really trying to look at how can you get in your steps over the course of the day? So maybe you park at the back of the parking lot and walk in. Now, if it's raining, you don't have to, but most of the time, you know, you could park in a different parking lot. You could take the stairs instead of taking the elevator. You know, at lunchtime, you could bring your lunch and then go take some laps around your office building. Or if you work on a farm or wherever you are, go take some laps and then eat lunch. You know, getting in those three short spurts of action activity, 10 minutes at each increment can be very important and a very manageable way to get an exercise, especially if you don't love exercising. You know, balancing, you can sit on an on an exercise ball. If you're at a computer or you're watching TV, that can really help improve core balance. I often recommend that people do push-ups and sit-ups in the commercials of their favorite television show because again, it's just adding a little bit of activity. And then if you have kids or you have grandkids and you're watching them at the park or maybe they have a, a sport practice, you maybe you're walking around that field so while they're practicing versus just sitting down and watching them. So there's lots of practical ways that you can begin to include activity into your day on a regular basis, seven days a week.